Hello everyone, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, and we are about to head into Cosmos Canyon. As you can see here on the screen, we've got our, our boy Red 13. I've also got my little Nanaki on. Love this shirt, I think it's hilarious. Um, and yeah, so we are going to hit up Cosmos Canyon finally. It's actually been a couple, I think it's probably been about two weeks since I've played this because I got so far ahead in the... Uh, I got so far ahead in the uh, uploads, so I decided to take a small break from it, but we I, we are ready to go. Let's do this. Hey, so I've been meaning to ask you something. You said old Sephiroth's come back from the dead, right? And that that's interesting. So, what I want to know is, how did he do it? And what's he after? He wants to save the planet. But... Wouldn't that make him a good guy? It's not what he's doing, but how. He doesn't give a shit if everyone dies in the process. Sounds like a total nutter. I mean, there's not much point in the planet if there's no one left to enjoy it, is there? That said, let's not forget that we still got a whole nother problem. One that's reared its ugly head time and time again. Bunch of assholes who won't stop till they play the planet dry. Shinra. Hmm? To hit him where it hurts, we'll need to leverage those connections of yours. But if you even think about stabbing us in the back, I'm gonna hug and squeeze you to death. You hear me? Loud and clear. Loud and clear. <laughs> All right. All right, we got some baddies here. I feel you Got him. I think we can walk from here. Let's take in the scenery. Oh, oh baby. I think we're getting close to the bridge, right? By the way, I'm taking Barret and uh, I'm taking I'm taking Barret and Red and obviously Red for story purposes. And, yeah. um, I'm taking Red in for story purposes and Barret just because I feel like there will be a lot here that Barret has to comment on because of you know because in the lore Barret actually went to Cosmos Canyon after the whole thing in Corel to study planetology. So I'm hoping that there's a lot more lore expansion there and I want Barrett with me so he can make some comments. Like story beats I know that they'll automatically put him in, like they'll automatically have comments, but like, I don't know. I just think it's good to take Barrett in. Resources everywhere. Oh man. Oh baby. I mean look at it. Like seriously. How do you not how, how do games just get seen like this game, Horizon Forbidden... I mean, I know the first game was kind of limited because it was all based in Midgar, so they had... They couldn't really... Um, so they really couldn't do, like, lots of grand scenery like this. They really knocked it out of the park with this game. I, 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 I think they really did a fantastic job. Bravo remake project. Only the strong survive. 
Ooh, healing material improved. Look, I know you want me to ride you, but I, I want to kind of take in the sights. I know. Oh, there it is over there. I can see it. I want to know what those green things are. So, are the green things part of the Proto Relic quest, or are the the life stream crystals that we kept on coming across behind the closed gates? Are... Old Cosmo Canyon, a sacred sanctuary where the planet's greatest minds gather. It's beautiful, more than I ever imagined. Come on, let's pick up the pace. I can Wait a minute. Hear calling my name. Yeah, me too. I thought, I thought Barrett had been there. This is beautiful than I ever imagined. Was that... Is that a change? Or is that just something I made up or I heard somewhere that maybe that's what he did? Okay, well... I know I heard someone say somewhere that... that Barrett went to... Cosmos Canyon after after the incident in Corral and studied planetology. Or maybe that's just head cannon that somebody had. Maybe that's what they thought he did so that, you know, since it was so close. And that's what put him on the path of the of Avalanche and everything. I don't know. Okay, well, I guess. Bye, box. Bye. Ooh, 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 baby. Can we get a good picture here? Trying to get the uh It's hard to actually get the like the whole thing. And yes, I am thumbnail searching, because y'all know how I do. Freaking gorgeous. There we go. There's at least. There we go. Kind of, sort of. We'll see. Maybe. Maybe that'll be a good one. I don't know. Okay, time to focus. Time to focus. There's Chadley. Hey, guys! It's me! Uh -oh. I'm back! Nanaki? I can't believe it! It really is you. <laughs> we were so worried. Oh, come on. Whoa. Oh. Now, why don't you go pay your respects to fellow Bugenhagen? Come on. Yep. There's Nanaki. Uh, you can let them through. They're good people. I promise. After all, they're the reason I'm here. What in the hell was that? Hey guys, it's me! Who? <laughs> He's such a softie. 
real quick. Gotta check something. An airship dropped these on us this morning. Wanted posters of the terrorists who bombed those reactors. Hmm. But I think we can say you had nothing to do with all that. Even if Nanaki hadn't vouched for you, it's obvious. <laughs> Welcome to the sanctum of planetology, Cosmo Canyon. Wow. That's, that's a lot more. Travel is unavailable. Party selection locked. Queen's Blood players await your challenge in Cosmos Canyon. Also, I I was watching somebody who, um, ooh, hello Tifa, those hips, ooh, baby. Um, I got all flustered. Um, I, I was watching somebody's let's play from before, like somebody who and they just made it to Costa del Sol. That's how far, you know, behind they are. Um, and apparently you can play some Queen's Blood players in Costa del Sol in the Queen's Blood game thing, but there's, like, individual matches. So I obviously missed those. So I might have to go back and do those if I want to do Queen's Blood stuff. Okay, okay. There's a lot of people here. Taurus? Tourism? Okay. Oh, God. Wow, there's a lot of people here! Must be that way for a reason. Gotta keep on our toes. Love the music. Love the music. Buy one of these and the souls of our ancestors will surely grant you good fortune. I mean, they gotta earn money somehow. Alright, wait a minute. Before we... So really, there's nothing much to do. There's the message board. And then there's Chad. Oh, that's the fire ring. Cool. You know, I didn't really realize how long I had been doing, like, side quest stuff, because I did all of Gengaga side quest stuff, and then I did all of Cosmos King. So there's probably, like, a good ten parts of just, like, not side quests, but, like, just exploring and... God, there are, there are fire rings everywhere. Wait, who's in my party right now? So... Oh, I'll take that. Ooh, wow, we are about to level. I will absolutely take Tifa and Barret. Firing from the OG, very nice, very nice. 
Elevator? Nice. Yeah, I've already done Bonds of Trust. I'm sure some more of that will open up. In. I wonder if that's the actual name from the original. I never even really realized it had a name. Such a weird thing, though, seeing it as a tourist attraction. Hello, Queen's Blood player. I will play you later. Oh, there's a frickin' piano! this one. I'm sure it's Cosmos Canyon. Two legs, nothing to it. We will do that later. I'm not playing the piano right now. There's no finer sound in all the world. Than yeah, yeah, yeah. Disempowerment materia. I've already got that. They aren't really giving me much reason to... They aren't really giving me much reason to, uh... Play. I regret that I... Hey, guys enjoying your time here at Cosmos Canyon? Cool. By the way, if you hear anybody in the background, that's Agent Tim Gamer. He wanted to see my reaction to some things. Hello. So... I don't know how I feel about this becoming a big tourist attraction. I, I don't know. Are they singing or is that... Who is singing? That's gotta be them. Advent Children? I'm trying to remember what that's from. Maybe from Advent Children. No, it's not from the original. Okay. Canyon Cloud, a long standing dream of mine has finally come true. Planetology rejects our mako consuming society, insisting that we have much to learn about this world. And now we have the opportunity to share in their planetary knowledge. I don't think there's anything really in the combat simulator I haven't done. Yeah, not really. That's the smell. So I gotta, I still gotta assess several baddies in the Cosmos Canyon area. What does it give me? Enemy skill materia. Rancid breath. I can't help but wonder where we'll meet next. So many fascinating possibilities. It feels like. Okay, so where are we heading? Let's 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 kind of focus on that. Okay, so I think actually, were we in the right place? Okay, now this is what I call being in the 
Again, I don't know how I feel about this being like a tourist attraction. I don't know. I mean, it. I, I just am not used to so many people being here. Oh, the materia shop. Ooh, weapons. Oh yeah, we did open it up. Why, yes, I am. We already got two warding. Conversion. Yeah, we really have all this stuff. That's one thing that really gets wasted in these games, is shops. You you don't go into shops and... Yeah, I didn't buy anything. Um, They really waste the shops in this game, because you really don't get anything from the shops and I get it like you hmm. well I've seen worse oh okay. congrats you're welcome to shop here thanks Ooh. oh we already got the red megaphone road warrior bangle snail shell bracelet do we need those or did I upgrade those already We don't have any, but do I have the upgraded versions? Don't you dare use my weapon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, don't use my weapons for anything unsavory. Okay. Yeah, that's So we do have the enhanced ones. I mean, I guess I can buy one more and then upgrade them if I want. Unsavory. Yes, I, I, I will only buy... Oh, okay, well, I have money. Does that, does that deem me worthy? Better watch how you wield those things now. All right, item transmuter. No. I thought I had a spirit bound. What do we, oh, the Road Warrior is the one we bought. And we need more exquisite B-sides for that one. Yeah, we'll hold on to them. Because I think everybody's got decent... Wait a minute. Ooh, I need to get... I definitely need to get... Enough for those. The Resplendent Bracer and the Yggdrasil Armlet. Especially the Yggdrasil. God, we have nothing. Oh, uh, we need Planet Spirit, which is, I'm, ass I'm assuming, Evilheim. The history of Magnata books can be traced back to Cosmo Canyon itself. Mm. May the planet bless you with wisdom. Thank you. But we don't really need to upgrade anything. We only have ten. I know they're going to start probably...
they're probably gonna start uh, kicking the uh, you Queen's for? Blood. Queen's Blood has not been very prominent the past bit, so I'm pretty sure. This place is just as confusing as Cosmos Canyon, the area. Although I feel like Gungaga was more confusing then. I was born and raised here, in this canyon. I was to become a Watcher of the Veil like those before me, until I was taken by Shinra. Now that I'm home and have repaid my debt to you, I plan to serve my village once more. I appreciate all that you've done for me. Thank you. We're really gonna miss you, Red. Oh, don't say that. You're only making this harder. I mean, I wish we had more time, but this is my duty. I suppose it was your duty to act the old man. I wanted you to treat me as an equal, not a dog. No, I'm not kidding. Is that you, my boy? Uh-oh. Coming! Oh, wow, he's... So... Was that goodbye? Nah. I'm sure we'll see him around the canyon. The real question is, why'd we come here? To learn the secrets of planetology. Come on! Can't forget that material! As for me... Ah, that will do. On the steps, where people I'm can step steal on steal some shot eye, if you don't mind. Then, we can see the sights. Okay, so now it's... Aries, Tifa, and Aerith. Sorry. Oh no, wait, we still Barrett. Okay. Even though. We've already seen the sights, so let's just keep on going. Queensville player. Don't know if I'm ready to dive into Queen's Bloody. Oh my god, how many? Though the road ahead is unknown, we are not afraid. For we walk with the great mother at our side. We need only open our hearts to the planet. Lift your gaze to the heaven. If you ask me, planetology is the future. A lot of folks downplay the planet's peril, but if they saw the weapons up close like we did, they'd have no choice but to acknowledge how bad it really is. Folks around here, though, they get it. They want what's best for our planet. You can see it in their eyes. Wonder if it ain't too late to recruit them to Avalanche. So, I wonder, is that well closed off because it's done, or if it's closed off because... Okay, well, move! Y'all are standing in the way. Is that where he was heading? Let's 
Seminar is in progress. Please be respectful. Planetology Assembly. Blessings of the planet upon you. Disciples of her teachings gather here to share their experiences. Through these seminars, we learn from one another and together enrich our lives. Participation in the seminars requires a special invitation from a mentor. Without one, I'm afraid you cannot join. Oh, okay. Perhaps you might instead consider taking part in the River of Lights ceremony. I suspect you'd enjoy it. Big. Jeez, Pete. Already I Over the practice of mindful breathing. Since time in the book. My precious material, where are you? No need to be shy, come out. Yuffie's gonna take you home. and sisters lend an ear to the winds and walk the path of discovery okay there's another queen's book man how many queen's book players are there here like like three four Back down there. Oh, snaps. <laughs> Fancy running into you here. Say, how about I get a shot of you giving thanks to the planet? <laughs> Aerith peeking behind him. I don't know, maybe. Maybe, we'll see. That might be a thumb. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. The canyon's also famous for its unparalleled view of the starry night sky. I made sure to bring all my night photography equipment along can't sleep until I've got the perfect starlit shot. Just let me know if you find any good photo spots. I invite you to do so now. Mm, there's another one. Or did he not have one here yet? Maybe he didn't have one here yet. I remember Gungaga's. I don't remember this one. I do kind of wish you could glamour your weapon to look like the Buster Sword. I kind of like him having just the Buster Sword. Like in uh, like in 16 when you could glamour your weapons to look like... Well, and I mean, obviously you can do glamour in many other Final Fantasies, not just 16, but... Ooh. Ah, not so fast. Sorry, but visitors aren't allowed in here. You see... This is where we keep all our valuables. Oh. Okay. Well, then we will progress on.
Ah, Bugenhagen. Who are you? Hi. Only those who have the key, as well as fellow Bugenhagen's permission, are allowed inside. Okay. What is? I kind of wish there was something like this in, in our world. If we've anything to fear, it is Just like a place that... Alright. Oh, these are the friends I was talking about. <laughs> Thank you for looking after Mama King. My name is Wugenhagen. I teach planetology here in the canyon. One I am Professor I Charles Xavier. I write on materia instead of a... I doubt there's a thing or two you don't know about it. <laughs> well, it might seem that way to a child like yourself. I'm not a child anymore. I'm 48. 40 what? <laughs> <laughs> Nanaki here has a long life ahead of him. In human terms, I would say he's about 15 or 16 years old. That's more than old enough. I can protect our Vale and everyone in it. Which is more than I can say for my good-for-nothing father. Oh, 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 oh. Speaking of the members of our little community, have you announced your return to one and all, Nanaki? I was kind of hoping to see more of Nanaki's... Like, Not kind. Yet. Be right back. Unless that's where he's going now. <laughs> but where are my manners? Like, they're adding all these Please, people, but... Come in and have a look around. <laughs> so I wonder if that's float materia. My devices piqued your curiosity. They are essential to my studies of the planet. I mean, they're everywhere. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Those devices are testing the pull of gravity. <clears throat> like I'm playing Ghostbusters, all the books falling over. I never thought you could become even more enchanting. And yet, here we seek to gather the wisdom of the planet. Wisdom. Don't you worry, my dear. I'll find a way to bring out the full depths of your beauty. Cross my heart. The stars have taught us countless lessons over the years. <laughs> you recognize that little scamp? I'll have you know that in his childhood, Nanaki was quite a handful. I believe it. Wait, so what was, what was up with the materia down here? I thought I had to look at that to progress the story, but... If it's just looking at a bunch of stuff... While that may appear to be little more than a glistening mineral at a glance, it is, in fact, a crystallized collection of our planet's memories. It's like you're singing to me of the planet's wisdom. Don't say you worry, my dear. Raw materia. 
That's a scale model of our planet and the surrounding stars. One could say the dust it's collected represents the people who live upon it. Hmm. Hey, what you doing? Okay. You love that material a little too much there, buddy. I don't want to know where that material has been. Seek to gather the wisdom of the planet. I hope they explain what happened to like I know that they do explain what happened to like Nanaki's father and some of the and some of his people, but Grandfather Clock. That is one of the first Marco detectors ever built. Ooh. Yeah. Hmm. No, I suspect it can't detect much now. Maybe. Okay. Nanaki never had much exposure to the outside world. I can only hope his travels with you have served to enlighten him. the power of the wind to produce new airflows of its own. Perhaps mm. you've encountered them before during your travels. Yep. I'll just borrow this. Can't get over how awesome this area looks. <laughs> Let's not be hasty. I'll show you that room later. Ooh, oh, is that the red room? Arr. Look at that! Look, look in the corner, the up there in the corner. <laughs> this big old, like we are literally underneath the telescope. stars than through this scope <laughs> but the lens could do with some cleaning my apologies well you can float okay is there anything else do we miss anything Lights 
we observe here have traveled to us from the far reaches of time and space. To gaze at the stars is to gaze into their past, what they once were, eons ago. Can't say I'm all that interested in the future, but that's just how we're wired. I mean, it's true, like, they're using our physics for this universe's physics, which could be a universal, multiversal constant. Just wondering if I missed anything. Phonograph. That's the planet crying out. A sorrowful dirge indeed. One I've heard all too often of late. This tubing allows us on the surface to hear the inner voice of the planet. What we just heard didn't come from the planet, though. That was definitely the voice of a weapon. Hmm. You seem awfully sure of yourself, miss. Uh oh Because we saw them, with our own eyes. Two, in the Corel and Gungaga reactors. They were loud and huge. <laughs> A fascinating account. Were it true? However, such grand delusions could be a sign of Mako poisoning. Do see a doctor. Uh -oh. Um, excuse me? Oh. Oh, yes, that would do them some good. <laughs> Judging from everything you've said, the three of you are unfamiliar with basic planetology. But it is never too late to learn. Please, come with me. Okay. Sent to you our planetarium. While the Shinra building features the latest iteration, this particular one is my original design. Now then, without further ado. So if Nanaki told you they saw weapons, would you believe him? Like, huh. Very odd that they made him the doubting old man. Okay, here we go. Oh. Their solar system looks a bit different than it did in the original. I mean, it looked like Earth's solar system in the original. It's only the beginning. A shooting star. Planetology is not simply the study of the cosmos and the celestial bodies that dwell in it. Rather, it is a quest to comprehend the cyclical nature of life. Behold, the planet we call home. It was from its soil, so teeming with life, that mankind was born. And like all living things, man is fated to die. So, what happens next? The body withers and returns to the planet. But what of the mind, the spirit, the soul? Much like its former vessel, it too returns whence it came. To the great river where all intertwine and circle the planet without end. A cycle of continuous convergence and divergence. The ceaseless ebb and flow that is the life stream. An apt name. Though it is as much a reservoir as it is a stream, 
being the sum of the planet's spiritual energy. It is the very essence of our star, the blood coursing through its planetary veins. And if ever that essence were to be entirely depleted, Bye bye. Of course, these are but basic principles of planetology. So you're saying that Mako is spiritual energy, which we're using up? Just so. Siphoned from the planet and processed for industry, that energy can no longer fulfill its true purpose. It is fated to fuel man's machinery, then fade away. Okay, but does it actually fade away? I mean, what if it doesn't? What if it just returns to the life stream in a different form? Is that possible? A novel theory, suggestive of a lack of understanding. Well, Tifa and Bugenhagen are not getting along. However, that can be overcome with time and education. You rang? Please escort this young lady to our seminar room, would you? Right this way. Okay. Hey, okay. Can I come? I'm getting cult vibes here now. Miss that, or that just regenerated? I never thought you could become even more enchanting. Where? Thanks so much for taking such great care of Nanaki for us. Fellow Bugenhagen instructed me to let you take anything you think might prove useful on your journey. Check out the storeroom when you have a chance. Oh, okay. I thought we'd get it after we went into the, the knee caves or whatever, the knee caves? I don't remember. I thought there'd be like a red 13 wep like new uh, weapon up Ooh, move metals though maybe there's towards the bottom 5,000 wow you guys just store guild down here hey that's useful we'll take it One chunk? Okay. Oh, wow. Let's 
This goes down pretty far. I just expected this to be a room. This is like, oh, look at Nanaki. Oh, wait, maybe that's his dad. I think that's his dad. Oh, there it is. I figured there'd be a weapons chest in here. Just don't know who it's going to be for, but it's going to be... It's probably going to be for red. It's got to be. No, crystal megaphone. Okay. Very weird that... Hey. So it leads to the same place. Okay. Right this way. See what the crystal is ounding megaphone, which I haven't even really. It's two more. Although we lose any connectors, but it's more magic based. We'll wait on that one. Oh, wow. I don't know which way I'm going. Oh, am I going back up? Wait. Oh, there's the elevator, so we should probably go down through the elevator. Oh, wait. Whoops. I guess we went the wrong way. Thank you. Oh. Yuffie. I love how it uh is now dusk, so we'll probably be making it tonight. Put your faith in our this village is lame. Did you know none of the materia here is even real? And don't get me started on the planetologists. Bunch of blowhards in love with the sound of their own voice. Wow. Okay. Yuffie. People everywhere resolve to not take them. Within you all are the planet's thoughts and memory. I heard from fellow Bugenhagen. By all means. Please come and join the seminar. Follow me if you would. Which would you say is a more worthy person? Hmm? I knew Barrett would be around here somewhere. For the practice of mindful Look at this. They're holding some festival today called the River of Lights. Thinking it could be worth checking out. First, a deep, calming breath. Hey, what time's the next session at again? Hmm? I ask you this, who among you has looked at the planet? The planet speaks to the planet. A seminar is in progress. All right, well, I think what we're going to do is before we go into the seminar, uh, we are going, I'm going to wrap this part up. Next time, we will be going into the seminar and we will learn more about planetology. So... Yeah, with that all being said, everybody, thank you very much for joining me here today. If you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to Milk Toast Gaming. Um, if you haven't considered becoming a member, you know, we always we always appreciate the support. Plus, you get uh, some some benefits with, with that, too. Um, but yeah, so with all that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Catch you later.